Hi, today I will show you how I've made this toy car. Some time ago I've seen a great idea on Twitter. It is called Steamfy and it's the free 3D printable educational construction set toy you can download and make at home. It is a set of 3D printed parts, nuts, bolt, bracelet, beams, which you can 3D print on your own and make anything you want out of them. I really like the idea, so obviously I had to try it out. The first project that came out and is available to download is this rubber band driven car. I am sure that many more great designs are about to come soon in the near future. I just downloaded the files from the symphony.org and after printing all the parts I started to assemble it. It is really easy and the manual is great, clear and easy to follow, really top notch like IKEA or Lego ones. I printed the parts out of ABS, the white ones, PETG, the black parts, and the red, which are used for the tools. Yes, you can even print your own tools to make the assembly easier. Because the parts printed with ABS are a little bit warped and shrinked, I had to send them. As you probably already can tell, the possibilities of creating great objects using Steamfy are limitless, especially when you can 3D print a missing part or even design one on your own. Just free your imagination and creativity, only sky is the limit. Who knows, maybe Steamfy will inspire a new generation of young engineers. As it turned out, it is easier to assemble the car than to make it right. After mounting the cords and rubber band, I was having some issues with the drive. The rear wheel have too little friction and they just spin in place. And it looks like a teenager trying to move his BMW E36 for the first time ever. The last step in the manual is to add rubber bands for the rear wheels. But I couldn't find any of the right size to fit nicely and I got poor results. Then I tried using sanding paper as a base, but with no luck. I did what is best to do in those cases, take a break and rethink my strategy. The next day I just cut the old bicycle inner tube and it works great. I have some decent drive. Unfortunately my top distance is only like 20 centimeters. I think I need to improve. Let me know in the comments how far your car can go. There is also a special mode for the wheels. Extra tires printed with TPU for better friction. Maybe I will try it later. Let's show some love and support for Symphony.org project. Unleash your creativity by printing one of those great items. Maybe my other videos can also inspire you to make something. Check them. They are right there.